In this video, I'm going to show you how to correctly set up your browser for Amazon KDP business. But first, don't forget to subscribe and also hit the bell icon for further notifications. Link to my Facebook group and my free class with the opportunity to also check out my course is under this video. Uh, if you use Chrome or Firefox, uh, just like this, without any incognito window, what will happen after a while, your searches, uh, especially if I click on books, will be affected by your previous searches. Uh, right now, I haven't had the problem because I haven't used this, the browser for a while, but in many cases, I can see my previous searches on the first page when I'm doing niche research and that's kind of messing up with my uh, research if I'm looking for new niches and so on. Well, but if you just click on these three dots and you click on new incognito window, what will happen, let's type in Amazon, your Chrome extensions will not be active, so we have to turn them on. Let's go back and I'm just going to install this Chrome extension that we you, that we really need for Amazon KDP business. It's called DS Amazon Quick View. Add to Chrome, add extension and now should be active. And I'm just going to click on the, those three dots. Then I'm going to click on more tools, extensions, DS Amazon quick view details. And I need to enable allow in incognito here. Okay. And now I can go to three dots a new incognito window, Amazon, and it should be all nicely set up. I should be able to see Amazon seller rank in incognito as well. Ah, yeah, it's loading and you can see the Amazon seller rank. Just gonna go to books and check, but it should be there too. As you can see, you have incognito window and you have also Amazon uh, seller rank displayed just under the journals, under the products. 